I don't even know what I mean by that. Shut up. Mm -mm. Shh. Welcome back to Terrible Winter Lighting. Last week we've got started. I learned a few things filming that with a video. video. I will need to accept the fact that these videos will look not as good as I want them to be in the beginning. I will need to practice, I will need to film, I will need to edit and I will also need to upload it. That's my intro done. <laughs> I just had a conversation with my husband and he mentioned something that I like to pick up for these kinds of videos. So I mentioned earlier that um, there are a few things I learned from the first video and yeah I'm going to do a real retrospective. You look at what you've done and you see all the good things, all the bad things and all the things that you can continue doing. The good I was honest, I was real, I was myself and I filmed a few clips that were diverse, shorter, longer, different areas. Um, definitely can improve on that but that was a good start. The bad, the lighting, terrible December lighting, horrible, can't change that, need to have different additional equipment, can't afford that so we have to live with that. Another thing, I talk too much, I repeat myself, can stop doing that, need to stop doing that. And I need to start talking to the camera early in the process, you don't have to see me doing all the chores. No, a few of those things, B-roll is nice, but not like a minute long, no. What I like to continue is filming more diverse, even shorter clips that I can put into all of the different areas and also being me, being myself, being honest and yeah, that's a horrible angle. So we now know why nobody's filming themselves while laying on the floor. The idea for today's video is that I want to discuss, and discuss is a very broad broad word here because I'm just talking, um, a topic that I discussed with my brother-in-law actually and he didn't agree with me so I just wanted to share my thoughts on why I think it. The thought is that the doors are open for everyone. What I mean by that is every single person can be someone. So I know it sounds quite simple uh, in those terms, but it's quite hard to achieve, let's be honest. So in my world, uh, it doesn't matter where you were born or uh, what family you come from or what your past is. It doesn't matter, just ignore all of that. Just think straight to, this is your path, this is, your goal and then you work towards it no matter what it is doesn't matter doesn't matter how small or big it is and i need to believe that because otherwise it would mean that we don't have the ability to create our own future of course don't get me wrong it won't happen for everyone for every single person it's all about determination how determined are you to achieve that goal to reach that dream and, and call it your own. If you really 
really want it, then you just have to find a way to get it. It can be anything. That can be working longer, missing out on sleep, missing out on, on parties, um, missing out on anything. I'm definitely not where I want to be. I keep on searching, I keep on fighting, and I keep on hustling. What do you really want? Then find a way towards it. Do you want more money? Get a better job. Do you want more freedom? Start earning passive income. Do you want more joy? Then find a passion and stick with it. Don't let go. Some dreams are smaller, some dreams are bigger. Sometimes to achieve the dream, it takes a little bit longer. It doesn't matter. Don't, don't put yourself down because you have a bigger dream and it's, it takes a long time to get to it. You can get there. Don't let hurdles stop you from your dream. I know I'm rubbish at videography and editing, but I like it. It's my passion. I, I want that to be my new hobby, so I, I keep going. I want to have more joy and more passion in my life. It's that easy. I say it's that easy, but I also want more things. I want to have financial freedom. I want to be able to spend more time with my daughter whenever I want. I want to take time off whenever I need. I want to travel the world and show my daughter everything. I want her to experience all the cultures and all the countries and all, like, see everything. I want her to have a great life. And I also want to have a great life myself. I am searching for something that brings me joy and ideally also a bit of money.